this is my dorm room. It's Sarah Todd. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'm going to be giving you a tour of my dorm room and I'm going to be showing you all of the decorations I have and all of the adaptations that my college was kind enough to put in this room for me. I have an amazing room. I am so grateful for all that they did to it to make it functional and accessible for me and I know you all are going to love it as well. Yes, I do have a disability accessible dorm room and there is a bathroom in the room. Honestly, the bathroom is like the coolest part of this room. I know you all are going to love it, so make sure you stay tuned and watch the whole video so you can see how cool my bathroom is and all the stuff they did to it. It's amazing. And I'm really just going to show you my whole dorm room from the moment you walk through the door and take you around the whole room so you can see everything that I have in here. I know you are going to love it. So let's just get started. Okay, I'm wearing my mask because my door is open, but I really wanna show you how cool this is. So to get into my dorm room, they made it so I have a keypad lock because turning a key can be difficult for me. So all I have to do to open my dorm room is use this little card, which acts basically like a hotel room key card and just hold it up to the sensor and it beeps and unlocks and lets me in. And this is so cool because they did this specifically for me. None of the other rooms really have this. So this is really helpful and makes it so I can be much more independent when I'm getting into my dorm room. All right, now let me close the door and show you all inside. Now I can take this off since my door is closed but yes my door is amazing because it also automatically locks so i don't have to worry about locking my door it just automatically does it which is very helpful it is also very lightweight which is nice because opening heavy doors is really difficult for me so they made sure that my door was going to be light enough that I could easily open and close it so my door is pretty cool I feel like I'm kind of entering a hotel room every time I come in because I have this cool little card which I love but I know you all actually want to see the dorm room itself so once we're inside this is what you get to see let me show you so this is my dorm room. I love it so much. I'm obsessed. It's adorable. I'm so fortunate to have this room. But yeah, I'm in my room. I love it so much. It makes me so happy to be in here. I'm excited to show you everything. So I'm going to show you the whole room and I'm sure you'll love it. And again, make sure you stay tuned to see the bathroom because it's so cool. I promise you. Okay, so let's get right into it. <laughs> all right, so you're going to get a little tour of all of the items that are on my desk, just because I feel like that'd be kind of fun. So to start with, you have my desk chair. It has a Davidson themed blanket on it that my grandma made for me, which was so sweet of her and it just kind of spices up the room a little bit, makes my desk chair look extra cute. So I love that. Then here I have my MacBook. Obviously I need this for doing my classes online, doing homework and editing my videos. So I have this. I also have this lovely blue notebook right here. This is where I take my notes for my classes. Here we have my charging pad where I charge my phone and my AirPods case, which is actually charging on it right now. I love using the charging pad because I can just set my phone and AirPods case on it and I don't have to plug anything in, so it's a lot more accessible for me. I also have hand sanitizer because we've got to keep our hands clean, <laughs> obviously. And then I have this desk lamp right here, 
which is so cool because I can turn it on with a little button that I connected to it and I do that with my foot. So let me show you that because it's actually really cool. I have the button over here so it's more out of the way and then if I just hit it with my foot it turns on. There we go. I think that's really cool. <laughs> so that's mostly everything I have on my desk. But what's so nice about this is they actually added handles to the drawers on my desk for me. This desk didn't come with these handles on it and I wouldn't have been able to open it without the handles, which is why they added them for me. So on these drawers, I can easily pull them open, which is so awesome and I'm really glad that they made that accommodation for me because it's so helpful. And here we have the main part of my dorm room. This is my bed behind me, as you know, and you really see my bed right when you walk in the room. So you walk in and my bed is on the wall that you face right when you come through the door. And then I have my dresser right here that I also use as my nightstand and it has a lot of space, which is so nice. They also added these handles onto the drawers of my dresser for me, which was so nice of them because again, I wouldn't have been able to open the drawers without the handles. All right, now let me show you my bed. Obviously the bed is like the centerpiece of the room. It kind of makes the whole room pop and look cute. So I have a really cute gray blanket on the front of my bed. You can't see it all the way over there, but it says Davidson and has the little Wildcat logo and it says Sarah Todd under it. One of my friends gave this to me. Shout out to you, Caroline and Denise. I love you guys so much. So this is my cute blanket. I love it so much. And I got this really pretty, pleasing gray comforter and it has little pom-poms on it. And then I have like Tiffany blue sheets and I have my whole theme going on with Tiffany blue. So I have my little pillow that I can rest my back on. And then this pillow has little pom-poms on it. It's so cute. And then I have this really cute little llama that matches my pillows and my sheets. My mom gave this to me the day that I moved in as well. So cute. It's kind of a little inside joke between us. So that's why it's a llama. And then I have my buddy dog in his lamb sweater. I love him so much. He looks just like my dog buddy from home who I miss so much. So I love having my cute little buddy dog here with me. And then right here, I have this bed shelfie, that's what it's called. It's this little thing you can just attach to the end of your bed and then you can put stuff on it so you can reach it and you don't have to have a nightstand or something right by your bed. So I have my brush and one of my face masks on it right now. Usually at night I put my phone on it so that I can easily turn my alarm off in the morning. So I really love this. It's so handy and it doesn't get in the way. It doesn't like jut out too far into the room. So really cute. Highly recommend the bed shelfie if you're going to college or if you just want one at home. All right, here we are in the little kitchen area of my dorm room. It's mostly just counter space, but we just kind of call it the kitchen. So I have a lot of snacks over here. <laughs> I have tons of snacks in this basket and in this basket. I love having my snacks in my room because in the evening, it's just kind of nice to relax and unwind with the snack. So I brought a ton of snacks with me. And here I have my adaptive scissors that I've mentioned before. I told you all about these in my dorm room move-in vlog. So I use these 
to open a lot of my snacks that I have here. And then I just have like my water bottle, my Tide Pods. Tide Pods are so much easier than detergent for everyone but especially when you have a disability that makes it so manipulating objects is difficult for you because with the pods, all you have to do is take it out of the container and just throw it in with your laundry. So that is super helpful. And also with the laundry room, it's on the same floor as my dorm room. So I just have to go down the hall. It's a short walk. And they were so amazing at my school once again, because I had trouble opening the washers and dryers. So they added these little handles to all of the washers and the dryers in the laundry room so that I can open them, which was amazing. And they also lightened the door to the laundry room for me so I could open and close it because before when I tried opening it, it was so heavy, I could not open and close the door. So they made the door lighter for me and now the laundry room is completely accessible to me, which is amazing. And I've only done laundry once since I've been here these past two weeks, I'm trying not to do it too often because even though I can do it, it still is kind of a chore. It's more difficult for me than for most people. I have this hamper that I got because it's a rolling hamper. So all I have to do is when I have dirty clothing or whatever, I just put it in here. And then when I'm ready to do my laundry, I can lift the handle up and tug it along kind of like a suitcase or a shopping cart. <laughs> with me and I can just roll my stuff in my hamper down the hall, which makes doing laundry so much easier. And then this little platform here is one of the coolest things in my dorm room, aside from my bathroom. <laughs> they built this platform for me. So I have one out here at this sink in the kitchen area. And then I have one in the sink in the bathroom. And this is because since I have limited arm and hand strength, I can't reach my face or my head without resting my elbow on something. So I gave them the exact measurements that I needed a platform to be, and they made this for me. It's really cool because it's not stuck to the counter so I can move it if I want to. And so I use this by just coming up to it and putting my elbow on it and then I can like reach my face to wash my face. I can brush my hair. So, so cool. This is also how I put my t-shirts and dresses on. I put my arms through first, like on my bed or a flat surface. And then I come over here and lift my elbow up and go like this to put the t-shirt or dress over my head. So, so helpful super cool that they could make this. I'm really glad that I have it in here. It really helps me be more independent. And then I just have the sink, soap and hand sanitizer, of course. We also do have a fridge and a microwave in our room, which is so nice. So here we have the microwave and then the fridge is right under it. And I put this cute little magnet on it that says my dog loves Davidson. So I thought that was really cute and this is just kind of in our little kitchen area as well. This is the bathroom. So exciting. <laughs> okay, I'm in the bathroom. I know the fan is so loud in here. So I really hope that you guys can hear me clearly. I'm, I feel like I'm yelling right now. <laughs> but yeah, I'm in the bathroom. Behind me is my shower. I have this really, really pretty blue shower curtain with ruffles hanging up right here. And then here we have the sink. This sink is so nice. There's a lot of room. They actually were super sweet and changed out the faucet type for me because when I first got here, the faucet was one of those kinds that you have to push down really hard with your hand and then it only stays on for about 10 to 15 seconds and I just found it was way too hard for me to like brush my teeth and wash my hands with that kind of faucet so they actually switched the faucet type out to be the one that you just pull up and push down and it stays on which is so much better for me then right here I have my platform like the one that's in my room itself 
This one is basically the same. It's a little smaller, but it can also be moved. So if I want to scoot it a little, I can scoot it. And then I have my makeup here, here on top of this, so that when I'm like doing makeup, which I haven't done yet, or washing my face, or plucking my eyebrows, or whatever, I can put my elbow up here and still clearly see my face. So again, all I have to do is just put my elbow up here, and then I can reach my face, my hair, everything. So helpful. So glad I have this. It's amazing. And then over here, I just have like this little holder for toothpaste and stuff. I have some soap. So that's the sink area of my bathroom. Okay, so here I have this little storage area. This was actually supposed to be a nightstand, but I didn't really have a need for it in my room. I needed it more in the bathroom to store my stuff in here. So I have this pretty blue and green little storage area for my stuff. And then over here, you can see the trash can. I brought that trash can. I thought it was just really easy to use because it has a lid that swings. So it's easy for us to like put our trash in there. And then I can actually take the trash out by myself, which I was pretty surprised about, but I'm so happy that I can. Okay, y'all, now for the super exciting part that I know you guys are super eager to see. So here we go. Here's my shower. Again, we have this cute curtain that I brought. I love it so much. So just push the curtain aside. And then here we have the shower. My school was generous enough to recreate my shower setup that I have at home which is very unique to me and not <laughs> simple to do at all, but they were amazing and I gave them the measurements of exactly what I need and where and they recreated it. So this is incredible. I have this shelf right here that has my automatic soap dispensers that I brought from home. So I have one for my body wash and one for my shampoo. And all I have to do is just put my hand under them and the soap and shampoo them out. So they built this little shelf here for me to put my dispensers on. And then above that shelf, I have this other shelf that they built, which is the one for my elbow. So I just put my right elbow on top of it and then I can reach my hair to wash my hair. This is incredible because this shelf is really mostly what enables me to take a shower. If I did not have this shelf, I could not take a shower by myself. So totally amazing, incredible that they did this for me. So all I do is just put my elbow on it and I can reach my hair to wash my hair. Super incredible. I get so excited about that. I love the shower. It's a really nice shower. So they adapted all of that for me and then also I found this really cool razor brand called Billy that I like, and my mom got one for me because we found out that they have this little piece that you stick to the wall, and then it has a magnet on it, and so does your razor. So your razor can stick to the wall through that little piece, which is so nice for me because then I don't have to worry about finding a place to put my razor. So I have my razor right here, and I can just take it off the wall, and then there's the little piece that it sticks to right there, and then I can easily put it back. This is my favorite part of my shower. They totally went above and beyond here with my accommodations. It was just incredible. I love Davidson. It's such an incredible school. So I originally thought that they were just going to make the shower knob easy for me to turn so that I could turn the shower on and off and adjust the temperature appropriately. But they put in the shower control that I have from home with buttons on it to turn the shower on and off and adjust the temperature, which is incredible. So all I have to do to turn my shower on and off here is go to this little button right here and hit it and then the shower is on and they also made it a rain shower head because that makes it easier for me to rinse all of the shampoo out of my hair.
attachments, I don't have great hand function. So I have a rain shower head too. So incredible. And then to adjust the temperature, I can just turn these buttons up and down. It's at 101 degrees Fahrenheit right now, which is usually where I put it. And yeah, so that's how you adjust it. And then you just hit this button to turn it off. So cool, right? Oh my gosh. I have the best dorm. I'm so thankful that Davidson was so accommodating and did all of these things for me because these accommodations really do make a huge difference in terms of my independence. But yeah, isn't this incredible? Like, this is seriously amazing. So, so grateful I go to such a fabulous accommodating college. So yeah, that's my dorm. I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I love my dorm. I feel like it's really cute. It's decorated well, if I do say so myself. <laughs> and the college just did a fabulous job making these accommodations for me. I never could have imagined that my dorm would turn out this great. And it truly is amazing. So I'm so, so thankful to Davidson College for making these accommodations for me. They are such an accepting school. I already love going here and I've only been here for two weeks. I'm loving it. So I'm just full of gratitude for Davidson and all of the people who have made my living here possible because I wouldn't be able to live here without these accommodations. So it's amazing that they made this happen for me. I would love to hear your thoughts on my dorm room. I hope you like it as much as I do. I love my dorm so much. Also, be sure to check the pinned comment of this video for my P.O. box address to send me some fan mail. If you send me a letter, I would be so happy. I literally love getting mail. So feel free to send me some fan mail. The address is in the pinned comment of this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a like, leave me a comment, hit that subscribe button, and remember to hit that notification bell so you never miss a video of mine. I post new videos every Tuesday at 3 p.m. Eastern and sometimes Fridays at 4 p.m. Eastern. So I hope to see you at the next one. Bye guys.